Hey everyone, I just want to show you today how to activate and deactivate rain mode on the X generation Fazua remotes. Now this will be the, here on the far left, we've got the BX remote for the handlebar. In the middle, we've got the FX remote for the frame. And on the right, we've got the RX remote for road. Now this has a 31 inch clamp on it. Now you could still use it on a flat handlebar like a mountain bike. Um, but uh, with that large clamp, you're not going to be able to put it by the grip. So the BX remote here uh, does have a 22.2 clamp, and that will fit next to your grip. So let's put the other ones away. We're just going to focus on the, uh, the RX remote here that's currently plugged into a, uh, a bike. And we're going to turn the bike on. And uh, while you're riding, you may experience uh, the ride mode randomly changing on you. And if that happens... What you'll want to do, uh, this is usually due to the sensitivity level being too high, or you're actually riding in rain and the rain is causing the mode to change on you. So to deactivate these touchpads here, and currently we can see that they are working, I'm going to hold the center button for two seconds until I see a blue LED trickling down, just like rainfall. And now we know we're in rain mode. So now you can see the touchpads are no longer active. And all I need to do is click the center button to... Uh, cycle through my ride modes. Now to come out of rain mode, I just need to do the same thing, hold it for two seconds, but this time we're going to see an orange LED just like that. And now we know we're back in what you could call sunshine mode or regular mode. And now our touchpads are functioning again. If you do have a 12 volt connector box to power lights, uh, you will have to come out of rain mode in order to click the center button to turn the lights on and off. Um, once you have turned your light on or off for the ride, then you can hold that center button and go back into rain mode. So that's it. That's how you turn uh, the X generation remotes into rain mode. And um, remember if uh, the sensitivity settings, if this is happening um, randomly, that you can go into the toolbox program and change the sensitivity levels. And uh, you can wash these with just regular uh, soap and water. Um, and uh, just don't use any abrasives, anything that would actually like take off the paint and stuff like that. So uh, usually just soap and water, get all the oils off of it, keep it nice and dry, and uh, you should be good to go. Thanks.